So, uh, could you tell us a bit how you came to uh, uh, to write about the uh, Actinida series? And uh well, some 14, 14 years ago, I saw a girl in my office, yes. and her um, problem was that she started vomiting every six weeks, okay. and that vomiting was so severe that she had to recover in hospital. Um, she showed a very uh, a wise and peaceful uh, in my office and that was totally not childlike. Uh -huh. She did her, did her own consultation and she uh, reassured her mother how it was. Uh -huh. um, the same wise picture I had of the girl she showed at home when she was playing outside with her younger brother and sister, she uh, ran inside to her mother to tell her that everything outside was safe mm -hmm. and they could play. Mm -hmm. And then she ran outside uh, to play again. This, this behavior um, reminded me about uranium. And in the rubric, Paroxysmal vomiting, uh, there is arsenicum, but there is uranium as well. I decided to give her uranium metallicum and the remedy worked very well. Um, what changed in the child was not only the paroxysmal vomiting, but her old and wise expression disappeared and she started to be child again. Um, half a year, year later I saw in Nepal a woman who had um, cancer of the kidney and her husband told me that she was not allowed to know about the cancer mm -hmm. because my, might be she was afraid for it. She was operated and during operation they discovered that there were, uh, she couldn't totally be cleaned from the tumor. Mm -hmm. And when she was in our clinic in Nepal, uh, I uh, examined her and she ha had a lot of fluid in her abdomen. And in the rubric, um, abdomen distension, there's uranium as well. So this woman had the same expression as the girl had. That's why I thought about uranium metallicum. Okay. Um, when I gave that remedy to that woman, um, she didn't, she didn't uh, recover from the cancer, but she um, healed by inside. In some way uh, she lived longer than was expected and in some way she helped her husband to let her go. Mm -hmm. what, I, um, this, what I thought about the wisdom mm -hmm. of the woman and the girl is when you have that wisdom you have to explain about it to the world. And one year later I took by myself uranium because I had some problems. And from, with that remedy I felt, uh, I felt in some way peculiar. For the first time in my life I felt home in this world. Mm -hmm. So I I told myself, now I have to describe this remedy for homeopathic oh, okay. colleagues. Okay. That's how it started. That's how it started. But uh, in the meantime, uh, in the text I read, you have many combinations of the whole series, and uh, I think you at have the described time, it. At the time, I described the uranium and the thorium as well, uh, dolisos, which no longer exist, had many cells of uranium and thorium. And unfortunately, 
after the connection of Unda and Dolisos, they throw many remedies. Oh, they so, throw so you mean it doesn't exist, you cannot uh, uh, order it anymore as a homeopathic no. remedy? No. Oh, okay. So some pharmacies have uh, cells of uranium and uh, thorium, but the whole list of Dolisos uh, is no longer there. Okay, and they had almost all the remedies? Uh, yes, at that time they had. That time. Okay. So, so which remedies are there now uh, available? Uh, what we have from the se seventh series is radium. Yes. We have radium bromatum and radium iodatum. Iodatum, is it? Huh? Uh, we have actinium. Actinium nitricum, is it? Mm -hmm. um, thorium. Um, is some salts of thorium. Then we have uh, protactinium, uh, uranium, neptunium, plutonium, americium, curium, and we have californium. California. Okay. And when when you look at plutonium, we mm. have two isotopes of plutonium. The first one is uh, uh, proved by Jeremy Scher, and that is plutonium uh, 239. Mm -hmm. that, is the, um, that is the plutonium of the bomb. Uh -huh. um, now we have another isotope, and that is plutonium 236. Okay. And the plutonium 236 has more the expression of the eighth stage than plutonium 239. And uh, berkelium, that remedy we don't know in homeopathy, it's not true, it's not uh, potentized, but we have curium 244 and we have curium 248 and the curium 248 uh, uh, I have proved and it feels like stage 11 hmm. and then we have californium 249 and we have californium 252 and the 249 uh, I have proved and it feels like stage 12 and the 252 feels like stage hurting. Mm -hmm. And for most of the remedies we have the nitricum and we have the muriaticum. Okay. But from thorium and uranium we have an oxidatum as well. And what we had is an uh, um, aceticum the nitricum we have, muriaticum, oxidatum, and we, ha we have uranium arsenicicum, which is available from the Hahnemann Apotheek. Mm -hmm. okay. Most of the remedies uh, are from Helios, except Actinium, actinium nitricum is available from uh, Remedia uh -huh. and protactinium is from uh, the Leonardo Apotheke. Which one is protactinium? Protactinium, protactinium is okay. stage 5.